Oh, hi guys, today we're gonna make a craft from cardboard. Wait, wait, wait! Aren't we making Barbie dresses? Oh, Sammy, we've discussed this. Check out the schedule. Whoopsie. Guess I read it upside down, huh? <laughs> well, what craft should we pick then? Yeah, it's a very tough choice. <laughs> oh, Sammy, you're being too obvious. Why? I did nothing. Like, at all. Okay, you win. Guys, we're starting all over again. <laughs> You didn't see anything. I'll take care of that. Guys, check out this amazing fabric. The head of our fashion house will be very pleased. Oh, magnifique! Excellent! Who did such amazing statues? Why, you did, Mastro. Where can I put on my new dress? Ah, pas chance, miss. We take care of your measurements first. Sammy, are you sure we need all those measures? Absolutely. Here, look at my notes and make patterns for the bodysuit. Yes, boss. Okay, guys, let's see what we've got here. When paper patterns are ready, just cut them off. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Pop, I'm just gonna borrow this for a sec. Hey! Oh, my precious. Soon you'll become a beautiful dress and fulfill your purpose. Hey, are you talking to fabric? Yep. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That's so fast! <laughs> Next, we'll place the finished pattern on the piece of fabric. Hold them tightly together. Then we'll take scissors and cut out the outline. You're doing great! Be careful on that turn! While you were nagging, I've already finished. How does it look? Hmm, not bad, Susie. But I need to check it on my model first. Give me that. You know what to do, guys. Just repeat the same steps with other patterns that we've made. Aha! Uh -huh. I think it's time to call for magic song! Huh? Who's that? Oh, I'll show you! Whoa! Uh, this is magic song. You know her pretty well. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're well acquainted. So we have a lot of work to do. Well, you know, I founded this fashion house all by myself. Whoa! I didn't order any flying fabric! It's a sign to get back to the craft, Sammy! <laughs> Guys, this is the end of the first step. Ask an adult to help you with sewing machine, and you'll get such a cute bodysuit. Doesn't take care for a fitting. I just caught her stealing snacks from the kitchen. Well, well, like designer, like model. <laughs> Excuse me, I don't get your references. The bodysuit fits perfectly, so we can attach Velcro to secure it. Adults should help you on this stage. The needles are pretty cunning. Every princess has fallen by their curse. So supervision is a... Hey, Sleeping Beauty, did you prepare fabrics for the sleeves? Why? I asked fairy godmothers to do that! Oh, wow, what would we do without those magic creatures? <laughs> We're making big wavy sleeves, so we'll place a fabric strip under a presser tool. And make neat small folds! They look so cute! Guys, you can check it out! One piece is ready. Now we'll wrap it around a bodysuit sleeve and sew it up. Going further and further up the sleeve. And finally you get... Well, this won't do, Sue. Take it back. A dress with only one sleeve. Hmm, who'd like that? <laughs> huh? What do you say now? You definitely should check not as fashion, Sammy. Guys, since fashion is timeless, so stay tuned to learn all its trends. Guys, we've made additional ruffles to decorate the back and the front, too. Susan, you know what? We're like a big... Huh, just what we need to make a... Huh? <laughs> to make a magnificent long skirt. Let's sew a ruffle to the base and add more puffy layers. So are you ready to try on your new outfit? It'll be ready soon! Sam, while you were talking there, I made this. Look! When the skirt is ready, sew its ends to the bodysuit. Here and here. It'll look like a dress train. Use the sequence to finish up the dress! And our Barbie starts her first fashion runway. Sue! I need new pictures for my social media! Miss, please, my store is very busy. Uh-huh, a new customer? All right. And luckily, I have something for you. Take it for free, we're kind today. Wow, so pretentious. <laughs> Let's see what our designer creates this time. 
Whoosh! Oh my fat, it's a cute doggy! You pull yourself together! Okay. Huh. It looks kind of plain to me. Okay, and how about hmm. now? Say it's good huh. Say it! <laughs> of course it is. <laughs> huh, let's see what we can do with it. If we saw them together, it'll look much better. But where's the front side of the dress? Huh. Oh, my them looks so relish, Susie! Are you looking for something? Yep, you have it actually, thanks! Magic saw, I need your help. Aw, she's such a tight sleeper. Cute, but work cannot wait! Remember that we should make stitches on the inner side of the fabric. It's fitting time! Barbie number two, your turn. Wow! How is it? What about the size? Did you fit in? I'm ready! Holy cannoli! You look amazing! 70% of perfection! Huh? What? Holy 70? What's wrong? Nothing, just the dress isn't finished yet. We'll make it rainbow -y. Guys, get ready for a color splash. We'll make new ruffles of all shades. Now let's saw everything up. You can ask an adult to help you with the sewing machine or make all of the stitches manually. After that, I'll make the rainbow dress sparkle! Can't wait! The sequence looks so good on you, too. You huh? should start a new trend <gasps> amongst lines. Right! <laughs> then I'll keep some sequins for myself, just in case. <laughs> Hush, my darling, your fairy slime came to rescue you from the mischievous Sam. Spark at the Pericles! Oh, this silly magic wand! Still looks like you had to do it by yourself. <laughs> Oh, well. Okay. Oh! Thanks, Fairy Slime. Let me save you, too. Oh, thanks, Susan. Just throw that thing away! But it'll be such a waste. Instead, we can use it for a rainbow train. A few magic stitches plus another piece of shining fabric, and the train is done. Susan, I can't decide which belt is better. Oh, Tibidaba, they look similar to me. But I like the red one a bit more. What do you think, guys? Sue, are you done there? I can't wait to see her! Wait! We need to make a small presentation! Extras on the scene! Celebrities! Ouch! Shiver me cheddars! <gasps> Susie, looks like we have a candidate for a third transformation! Oh! Guys, do you want to see that process? Then stay tuned! Apparently, a modern Cinderella came to ask for help. I found the shoes of the right size! All we need is the right dress! The easiest part! <laughs> anyway, with these patterns, we'll send our princess to the ball today! First, we'll cut out the pieces for the top. We'll use different kinds of fabric for it. You're gonna look amazing! Trust me, slime designers are flawless! The first piece is ready. Let's prepare the others in the same way. Tulle fabric creates a soft blending effect. So let's add one layer to the top. And then sew the pieces together. You may need assistance here. Sissy, should I help you too? Huh? Well, if you find a zipper, that'll be great. Thanks, Sammy. Guys, repeat the same steps with other pieces of the top. Follow my lead. Well, we've already made a dress with zipper once. Let's work with Velcro this time. Ah, creative decisions. I like it. We'll place Velcro right here. There we go. Nothing complicated about it. And secure it with a few stitches. Like this. How about a skirt, Sammy? I have one! Wow. Looks like it's gonna be a big puddle skirt. Like for a real ball. All we need to do is attach a waistband in order to shape it. Thank you. Guys, you may ask an adult to help you here, as always. Well, is it ready? Let's see. Whoops, we accidentally hit our model behind. <laughs> <laughs> you have to fold it in half, Susie. My bad. Okay, this'll do then. Now it looks right, huh? Let's put the skirt and the top together with an inner seam. Uh um, where is my princess? We have a date to come. Wow, Sammy, I haven't known that you're royal blood. Of course I am. <laughs> but it's just for tonight. Oh, the princess went MIA all of a sudden. She looks so weird. I mean, the dress is great, but the hairdo. Whoopsie. I haven't finished yet. Susie, wait for time. 
Then we can add one more detail, guys. The sleeves. Whoosh! One more. And here's the result. <laughs> oh, I can finish it and the bow is so soon! Uh -huh. huh? Maybe someone magical can help us. <gasps> You're right! Fairy Slime will save the day! Bibbity bobbity subscribity! Let's have a look at all of the three beautiful dresses for our slimy fashion house. dress will be for me. Bye, guys! <laughs> Hit the bell button and we'll defo see you in the next video. Cheerio! <laughs> Bring it on, Sue! Hold on tight! Hey, guys! Today, we will unbox this huge package! And inside, we have the DIY Glitter Factory LOL Surprise! Here, we have a ball for the doll makeover. From plain into a super bright one. We're free to choose any design we want again and again. This can be done with four glitter colors. And four fuzz colors. Let the makeover begin! Guys, check out how many cool stuff we have here! For example, this spinning display. It has sockets for the containers and dolls. And right in the center, we'll install our magical ball, which actually reminds me of the astronaut training machine. But the most mysterious thing here is the case box. I wonder what's in here. Dun da 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 da! Oh, it's a whole bunch of blind bags! What a fortune! And what's this? Oh, I guess it's a sticker with the name of our dolly, Makeover Babe. Hmm, sounds nice. Oh wow, we are baggy billionaires! First thing that caught my eye is the baggy with a cucumber face mask. Looks lovely. I wonder what's inside. Huh, these are cucumber face masks of different colors. We can choose whichever we like. Look. Pink, blue, purple, yellow… It's so awesome! Well, I guess we'll just keep opening them one by one. And in this one we find a skirt! It's completely white. Like a canvas ready to be painted on. <laughs> I think it's pretty cool that we can create our own doll. Whoa! Look! These are the applicators. We'll use them to apply the glue on our doll. We also have special sockets in the playset for our applicators. Woohoo! <laughs> but we keep moving on. What? What's in there? <gasps> oh, we're so lucky! Check out these super stylish high heeled boots. Fancy. Let's inspect the biggest baggie. Oh, what a lovely color. Huh. I suppose it's a glue bottle, which looks like hairspray. <laughs> How cool! Hmm, the instruction tells us that the teal colored glue is for the glitter. There also has to be pink glue for the fuzz. And here we find an absolutely white bottle. We'll decorate it too. Yes! I wish we could get some more clothing. Aha! <gasps> uh -huh. Here it is! We found a fur top! Ooh, very classy. 
Huh, everything that we found so far looks like a Snow Queen's wardrobe. Let's check the hot pink baggie. Oh, it's a doll, but not a regular one. Ooh, in fact, it's a mannequin, which we'll dress up to do some coloring afterwards. This way, our doll will stay clean. <laughs> huh, not so many left. We're moving really fast. Pop! Ooh, what a cute headband with a bow! Susie, what are you up to with all this girly stuff? Well, I'll make our dog glittery and fuzzy. I want to be glittery and fuzzy too! Sammy, you're as handsome as you are. Plus, you won't fit in this ball. Huh, we'll see about that. Oh, Sammy is like a magpie. He sees shiny things. He's there in no time. Oh, here's the second glue bottle. This one is for the fuzz. These bottles are totally awesome. And we only have three pink baggies left. And in one of them, we find an adorable top with the straps in the middle. Oh, wow. Hmm, which one to choose? Let's do this one. Like this. Oh, it's another skirt. Looks to me like a denim one. Let's try the small baggie. And then we'll open our doll. <gasps> Ooh, it's a bristle brush. Soft and flat. It has its own socket in our factory. Only one baggie left, and we will finally meet our star! Open up! Whew, this one's tough. And... Oh, look how lovely she is! Her hair is snow white and ready for the makeover. <laughs> okay, now we have everything ready to open our factory. First of all, we need to protect our doll's face from extra glitter using one of the cucumber masks. We'll fix the doll nicely in the holder, like this. And now we need the teal glue for the glitter because her hair will be all glittery. We cover her hair with glue very carefully, not missing a spot. It's actually not as easy as it seems, since we want the hair to look perfect. Then, we'll pour the glitter in one of the halves of the ball. The hair of our beauty will be golden. Then we place our dolly here, like this, and cover it with the dome. Ooh, don't forget to close the heart-shaped latch. Let's install the ball into its initial position. And here we go! <gasps> Ooh, look, she's getting all glittery golden, so shiny! Time to check the result. We'll push aside the latches. And here comes the exciting moment! <gasps> Ta-da! Wow, so much gold! We need to let her dry for a while, though. Don't throw away the extra glitter. It can be used later. We'll pour it carefully back into the container. <sighs> Oops. While our dolly is resting, we'll prepare some clothing for her. For the makeover process, there are special hangers, where we'll put our skirt like this, and then the top goes on the second hanger. For the outfit, I decided to be minimalistic and use the black fuzz. It looks very comfy. Now we pour it inside. Which glue should we use for our fuzz? Correct, the pink one. Here, it's better to use the black brush. Splat, splat! And we start the process. It's the same as before. We apply the glue super carefully. We want this outfit to look flawless, so I'll take my time and go slowly, especially with the fur top, since it has so many details. Now we install the holder in the ball, cover it, and close the latches securely. We don't want any of the fuzz flying around. Everyone is ready for the magical transformation from white into black. Let's go! By the way, you can turn the pink holder vertically so every inch of the outfit gets totally covered with fuzz. It's so much fun to watch it spin! And done! Ooh, let's hurry up and open it. I really want to check out the result. So let's see. Oh, it got covered so nicely! The collar and the cuffs look as if there's some different color on them! Okay, are you ready for the makeover? Ta-da! Yes, I'm ready! 
Sam, I need this. But I want to shine and sparkle. Uh. Guys, give a thumbs up if you want to see my makeover. Let me finish with the doll first, and then we'll think this over. Uh, okay, I'll be back. <laughs> Looking forward to it. Guys, meanwhile, we'll apply the glue for glitter onto our accessories. And don't worry if the mannequin gets dirty. That's what it was made for. Soon, these Snow Queen boots will transform into Dancing Queen shoes. Headband and boots will be turquoise and very sparkly. I can't wait to see! We'll assemble our construction like this. Ayoop! Uh, now we close our balancer really well to keep her safe and put the ball in its holder. The glittery cloud is launched! Woohoo! Now we turn the doll into the horizontal position. And we keep rolling! <laughs> oh, let's check out the outcome. We open one and two. Ta-da! <gasps> wow, she's fully covered with glitter and looks like a mermaid. Or an alien girl. <laughs> we'll let her dry. I guess our golden girl should be ready. Time to remove the mask. Oh, hey there, beauty. Extra glitter can be removed with the bristle brush. Just like this. I like the glitter, but there's still too much of it on our dolly. Da 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 Done and done. It's perfect from every point of view. <laughs> Let's hurry and get dressed. Da 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 here is my one and only adorable doll! I totally think that we chose the best combination of glitter and fuzz here. Plus, the gold and turquoise really match each other. Such a nice contrast. If I had an outfit like that, I would be the happiest girl in the world. And don't forget about the bottle specially decorated for our beauty. Here the color combination is pretty much the same, but instead of turquoise glitter, I used fuzz. The best thing about it is that we can wash everything off and create a new look. Let's do it. Yay! It's so easy and fun. You just roll the ball and decorate your doll the way you want it. The second transformation mission is complete. Mask off. Oh, wow! What a beauty! I am totally in love with this pink color. It looks so fancy. And just look at those shoes. Where can I buy those? <laughs> now I need her hair glittery too. But maybe next time we should try some fuzz? Hmm. Guys, which look do you like the most? This one or the previous one? Comment below and don't forget to shine. Bye bye. Bring it on, Sue! Hold on tight! <laughs> Challenge remains by the mozzarella. Go, go, go! Pass it, and you'll receive the honorable right to become one of my favorite toys! Sammy, what are you doing? <gasps> what happened to Barbie? Her hair and dress? She has to pass a series of challenges to become my favorite toy! It looks like you sent her to the jungle, to a volcano, and then decided to drown her. I've seen in the show people going through different challenges, and I should say Barbie passed them with dignity! But now she needs a day of relaxation at the spa. And where is the spa? Do you know any? We will arrange it together. Barbie deserves it. Definitely buy the mozzarella. That's a great idea. Let's go. Uh-oh. Oh. Sammy, be careful. Otherwise, we will need the spa for you, too. <laughs> get dry and let's get started. Okay, Sue. I'm ready. Hey, guys. Today, we will take care of our Barbie doll. Just look at her hair. What a mess. Sue, let's change your hair to this! I think Barbie will love it! 
Your idea is good, but Barbie needs her own hair, not a wig. Where did you get it? Well, Roger has brought it for you, and I'm just testing it. Well, not anymore. For me? But why? I didn't ask him to do that. You are hiding something from me, aren't you? Well, um, I've heard you wanted to change your image, and I'd like to help, that's all. Thank you, Sammy, but I was talking about changing my dress, not my hair. There you go. Now watch out, otherwise you might get soaking wet. I just realized that I forgot to water the flowers! Make this wet, please! Next time, water them on time. Or you'll have to buy a new one. Thank you, thank you! I will always remember that by the mozzarella. While Sammy's running back and forth, I will untangle Barbie's hair. You are gonna be beautiful very soon. The best helper ever is here with something for Barbie! I just need to find it here. What do we have here? A scrunchie, a hair clip, and some candies! Wow! Barbie doesn't need candy, she needs deep skin cleansing, but I don't have such small masks. However, I can use a brush and a toothpaste in our homemade spa. Oh, I see! But the candy isn't for Barbie, it's for me! Yummy! Oh, I got it, but now your face is covered in chocolate. <laughs> Clean it. That's my favorite candy! Pity it was the last one from the box Roger gave you last Saturday. I see you've stolen my candies again. We'll discuss it later. I need to wash the doll now. This water is good for my duck! Swim, swim, pretty ducky! Sammy, your duck is clean and Barbie is not. You had better choose a hairstyle for the doll. I can't imagine what Barbie had to go through if she is this dirty. I just hope Sammy didn't bury her in the pot with the plant he forgot to water. So I just decided! Holy cannoli! It is the best hairstyle for her! Well done, Sammy. That's not a very simple option, but I'm sure we can handle it. Great! Holy cannoli, my Barbie will look like the best doll ever! Sorry, mermaid, but it's a fact! Okay, but first of all, we should wipe her hair with the towel. That's right, Sammy. What do you think? Is our Barbie ready for the next step or not? I'm sure she is! And I can't wait to see you doing her hairstyle! All right, the Barbie's hair is already clean and we just need to comb it. I have a brilliant idea! Let's dye her hair as well! No, Sammy, don't even think about that! She will keep her hair color! Watch out! My scissors are sharp and I don't want to change your hairstyle! Sammy, you are so impatient as always. Wait a bit and you'll see everything for yourself. This process is not very fast and requires attention. Oh, I'll help you! Let me braid her hair! I know how! Hmm, I think. <laughs> no, Sammy, we don't need braids. The curls can be made in a different way. But I have to learn! Maybe one day I'll become a famous hairdresser! Oh, <laughs> really? And whose hair will you work with? Human? Doll? Slime, maybe? Oh, I think I have a name for your future beauty salon. Slime and tangled hair. <laughs> Doesn't it sound marvelous? It was my first experience. Be thankful I didn't pull out your hair that time. Wait, ducky. I just want to brush your hair by the mozzarella. Sammy, your duck doesn't have hair at all. Even in nature, it has feathers. Oh, no. I, I, I gotta go. Wait, mermaid. You do have hair. Let me brush it. <laughs> Sammy, look. All of your toys are already scared of you. Stop chasing them. Better come here and help me finish this process. I know, I know. You can't do anything without me. Abracadabra. Thanks, Sammy, but I'm done. Oh. Wow, Barbie looks like a Gorgon. I'm scared. What if she turns me into stone? What would I do? <laughs> Sammy, relax. She has curls in her hair, not some snakes. <laughs> All righty. Now it's time for making a dress. And this time we won't use any fabrics. Ooh, I want a new dress too. And I'm ready for that. Look at me. Sammy, I asked you not to take the wrap. You are not food to be cooked. And I suppose we can find clothes for you without using these kind of props. Guys, be careful here. Speaking of our dress for the Barbie, we'll take a bit of... Sammy! What? I just wanted to prepare the pieces of sticky tape for you. Ouch! Oh, you're all covered in that. 
Check it out. We'll transform it into a ball. Holy cannoli, it's time for playing soccer! I'll win the gold at the championship! Sammy is so funny sometimes. I wish Roger were here. I'm not a soccer fan. Hey, what's up? The doll's back is not a playground, huh? Oh, no! Sorry, sorry, Sue. I wasn't aiming at you or Barbie, of course. I'm afraid to think what he would hit if he was aiming at me. That's why I prefer to concentrate on making the dress for Barbie with the help of... Me, with the help of me! I brought nail polishes of all different colors! Now let's see which one of them will fit our Barbie better! The green won't do. Hmm. The pink, maybe? No, it doesn't work either. Ah, it's so hard to choose the right color! Sammy, I've already painted the tape. I've decided to use the blue one. But if you want, you can paint something else with your nail polish. I've already done it! Look at my ball! Now it's much more beautiful! I see! Check this out! I will add some glitter to the nail polish. What do you think? Wow! I think it'll look good on my ball! Yahoo! Where is my ball? Sammy, I hope you'll clean everything later. Sure! But now I want to help you! Should I add some glitter here? Thank you, but I had better do it myself. And you can take a break. By the way, you might think of a party for Barbie if she wins in your challenge. Party, party, party! Woohoo! It'll be so funny and happy and amusing and... It won't be like that at all if you use all the decorations now and make a mess on the floor. All of our guests will just fall down. It wouldn't look very funny, huh? So clean up here, please. Come on, Sue! It was so funny! Why are you so boring? Boring? Okay, next time you sleep, I'll take a marker and draw a mustache on your face. <laughs> It'll be the next day! And I will sing today! Hey, you singer! Check out what I've made while you were blabbering. The dress is finished. It just needs several last touches. Sue, what are you doing? Barbie needs this dress! Don't ruin it! I'm not going to. I just want to cut out the unnecessary parts. A few more cuts. Here we are! The dress is ready! These things should be moved to the trash can. Why? I can find another use for them! For example, it may become my crown! Ha! You can do whatever you want with that. I don't think Barbie needs it. Now we'll dress her up again, so that Barbie is the most beautiful doll at her party! Our curls are done, so these things are already unnecessary, too! Great! Give me a second, I'll show you what I'm capable of! I'll have curls, too! My party will be for the curl guys only! Shiver me, Jetters! Well, Barbie is ready for your party, but I don't think you should look like that! Stay away from me! I am sick! Sammy, Sammy, when will you become more careful? <sighs> One day our table will be broken because of your constant falling down. <sighs> I'm okay, I'm okay. Thank you for asking, shiver me cheddars. I just realized that I don't have a photo though for my party. That's awful. So I've decided to make it by myself. Who can do that better than me? Done. Check this out. Would you like to take a photo with this background? Looks cool! Sure, and I'll definitely do that later. I just want to finish the shoes for your Barbie. This is gonna be a high heel. Hup. High heel? <laughs> Check this out, Susan! I have a magic wand now! I see. So instead of helping me, you're just gonna do magic. Why don't I use my magic then to turn you into a party decor, huh? No, 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 Susie, please don't do that! I'm begging you! Sammy, you're so funny! I was just kidding! Of course I'll never turn you into something! Okay, truth! I've got something else! I saw that in the movie! I think Barbie likes that by the mozzarella! What do you think? I don't know about Barbie, but I would like you to do that for me sometime! I'm often so tired, you know! Anyway, check this out! It's like the Cinderella shoe! 
And she needs the second one! Bibbidi bobbidi subscribe! Your magic works! Here is your second shoe, Barbie! Now our doll can dance and have fun all night long! Her outfit is complete! Do you like the result, Sammy? Holy cannoli! Yes! My Barbie is the best doll ever! Sorry, mermaid! I hope it won't be one more challenge or a prank. I don't want to wash this pretty Barbie again, and I love her new hairstyle. I almost forgot to invite them to the party! No offense, only joy and fun! Woohoo! Let's take the group photo and then... And then... Aha! Then we'll start a new challenge! Hey, give her back! No, 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 Sammy! I think that's enough for today. Barbie is tired. Give her some rest. Maybe you're right. No! It's time for a challenge! Give it to me, I said! Come on, have mercy on that poor Barbie! Oh, what a stubborn slime! Oh, I guess I'll have to repeat everything again. See you soon, guys! Bye-bye! Oh, these are so beautiful and unusual. I'd love my outfits to take part in a fashion show one day. <sighs> but to achieve this, I need to study a lot and learn to create new outfits. Fashion design is amazing. I'm glad I started to study it. Hey guys, have you ever created your own outfits? Write in the comments. Right, and I need to practice. Drawing is good. But I need to move on to real-life outfits to understand how they'd look in reality. Huh. I don't have enough fabric. Can't do much with these. And who will be my model? I will! Oh, Sammy, thank you so much. But I, I want to make dresses. Oh, uh, I think I'll skip dresses. Oh, use your Barbie dolls! Are they sitting here for nothing? Barbie dolls? Oh, that's a wonderful idea! Thank you, Sammy! You're welcome! I won't only use dolls as models. I'll use Samantha's idea to use balloons! Do you remember the video where Samantha and I made these outfits? Give a thumbs up if you did! Susie, wait for me! Sam, do you remember where the box of balloons is? There were a lot of them left. Oh. Yes, yes, I'll go get it! Oh, and I'll get everything ready! Hi, everyone! We're going to hold a workshop on how to create simple doll outfits. And for me, it'll be fashion design practice. And for me, balloon is fun! Oopsie! <laughs> Can't do without fun! Here's your balloon supply! Great, Jenny, thanks! And for today's outfits, we'll only need colorful balloons of different types and scissors. Don't forget to be careful with scissors. And what will you start with? Hmm, let's see what we have here. Aha! These two balloons complement each other. I'll make a top from the blue balloon. We'll need the wide part of the balloon. I've always wanted to make an asymmetrical top. Right, this is the opening for the arm. And here's our stylish top. Let's make a cool skirt to match it. This balloon will make a wonderful pleated skirt. To make it, we'll need to cut off the top and the bottom part of the balloon. I also made something for myself from the balloon. <laughs> That's stylish. Yeah! 
And here's our skirt. Time to try the outfit on. Come here, beautiful doll. And... Oh, you forgot an important detail. What, Sammy? An accessory I keep hinting. Oh, right, right. <laughs> I'll use the remainder of the yellow balloon to make a hairband. I'll cut off this ring. And a piece of the balloon. Right, I need to shape it. Great. Now let's tie this piece around the ring. Done. Let's put it on. Carefully not to tear it. Great. And we also need... Shoes! Wow, Sammy, you can read my mind. I know a thing or two about style. <laughs> Wonderful. Right, let's see. Um, and maybe... Uh, ha! Yes, these. Let's try them on. One. And two. Now it's done! Next, I'll make a dress. It'll be fashionable purple. A ruffled balloon will be great for that. I only need to cut it on the top and at the bottom. There! Come here! You'll have to part with this beautiful angel costume, but there's an amazing dress waiting for you. Let's try it on carefully. Maybe putting a balloon on isn't very fast, but it looks elegant. Done! Only too simple. Yes, let's add a small detail. I'll cut two pieces of a balloon from the narrow part. And two. I'll put this piece on the top of the upper part of the dress, nice and slow, and I'll adjust it. Right, and this narrow piece will go through the wide one. And over the head. Let's smooth it all out, and voila! Time to add some accessories. These shoes will highlight the festive mood of the dress. And a bracelet. And a handbag. Done! Oh, from the heavens straight to the ball. Hello, me, mademoiselle. <laughs> And these two beauties also want new outfits. New outfits? No problem. I've got so many balloons left. Right, let's see which colors will suit each of you. Hmm, this is a wonderful turquoise color for you. And for you, this one. Uh, no. Oh, yes. So bright and sunny. And this clear white to accompany it. Let's go. I'll make a classic sheath dress from the turquoise balloon. Go on, and I'll select some accessories for it. All right, I trust you with this important task. Thank you, Susan, I won't let you down. Right, to make a strict sheath dress, I need to cut off the ring. We'll need it later. And the top of the balloon, just like this. Okay, now let's make holes for the arms. I'll cut out neat triangles. It's better to go slowly here. These are our openings. Time to put the dress on. And now we only need to decorate the dress with a cute belt. Like this. Take these shoes. Oh, wonderful, Sam. I couldn't have selected better shoes myself. One and two. And done. Beautiful. A very busy like elegant lady. I'm glad you like it. So let's dress you up as well. This wonderful sunny orange balloon will make a wonderful top. I'll cut it off here, at the top, and at the bottom, to make a narrow strip, but not too narrow, like this. Let's see. This top is called a bandeau. It doesn't have any sleeves. I think it's a wonderful top for summer. Guys, give a thumbs up if you agree. Wonderful. Let's add a cute detail to our top, a pretty wide ruffle. I'll just cut a piece of the balloon. Right. Let's try you on. Wow, it looks even better than I expected. And this balloon will make a cute summery skirt. We need to cut off the top and the bottom. Let's see how this pretty skirt will look on you. I also had a skirt like this. Very summery. Now, time for shoes. <laughs> All right, Sam. And now it's time to accessorize. Oh, these are wonderful summer accessories, Sammy. Gorgeous. So our summery sunny beauty is ready. I've 
Attention everyone, I present to you the first fashion show of our new designer, Susan. Oh, thank you. I'm so nervous. Don't worry, Susie. Your outfits are great. And please write in the comments which outfit you liked most of all. Bye! See you soon! Sue is off thinking about new designs. And you guys, subscribe to the channel to support her. Oh, and hit the bell button to see a new video as soon as it comes out. Awesome. This is so interesting. Hmm. <laughs> Whoa, what was that? I think I can hear Sam and a dog barking. Sue! There! Me! Dog! Sammy, I don't get it. What happened? I, I wanted to give you a new doll and, and I was bringing it to you. And the neighbor's dog took it and, and... Oh, I think the dog's left. A moment. With Sam, each day is an adventure. Oh, Sammy, she's adorable. No, she was adorable and the dog ruined it. Well, the doll is a bit tattered, but don't worry, we'll make it right. Come, let's fix up our new guest. You can count on me, Susie. Ta-da. Hi, guys. Today, we're up for a real rescue mission. We need to make this beauty shine again. Susie, I bought a towel, but I can't choose. This one. All right, what else do you need? Bring my basket with fabrics to make a dress. Will do. Right, and I'll take the ruined outfit off and wash her. There. Dun, 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 dun. She's good as new. Now let's brush your wonderful hair. I like brushing dolls. But I love making dresses for them even more. Ah, uh, Susie, we've got a complication. Oh? There's only one piece of fabric in your basket. What? But how? Oh, right. I used up all the fabrics for my fashion design classes, but this piece will be enough. And what can you make from it? Uh, at least four dresses for Barbie. What? No way! I'll prove it. Do it! This piece of fabric, 20 by 12 centimeters, is all we need to create several wonderful outfits for a Barbie doll. Do you want a balloon, Susie? Huh? What for? Guys, do you remember how Sue made doll outfits from balloons? Give a thumbs up if you do. That's what for. Oh, no, Sammy. This time, I want to work with fabric. Then you'll need sewing needles. No, Sammy, I won't. I've got everything ready. It's time. Uh, what's this? I'll take the thread at least. I don't need it either. So what will you need? You'll see, Sammy. Oh, by the way, can you bring doll shoes and accessories? Yay! Will do. Bring different ones because our dresses will be different too. So actually, the dresses are ready. I only need to put them on. So first, I'll put one arm into the opening I've made. And the second arm goes, as you can guess, into the second opening. Like this. And now I only need to smooth out our dress. It should be even on the shoulders. And on the back. Yes, wonderful. Susie! Here, I've collected these from our dolls. They're happy to help their friend in need. Wonderful. I'll need this waistband. There. I'll tie it on the back. And smooth it out again. I've already selected fitting shoes, Susie. Oh, awesome! I like them! Let's put them on our doll. Wonderful! Our first dress is done. This 
dress is too simple, Susie. Then you'll be delighted with the next dress, Sammy. Let's start with putting one arm through the opening again. Sammy, are you selecting accessories? Yes, yes I am! That's great! And I need to wrap the second end of the fabric around the waist. Like this. Tight and neat. And I'll tuck in the tip. It'll hold well. And the dress is ready! And here are the accessories and shoes, Susie! Wow, great taste, Mr. Stylist! Thanks! And what do you think of the dress? Huh, elegant, stylish, fit for an official reception. I like it too! Sue, you talk about several dresses, but you've shown only two! I'm starting on the third one. It'll be a cute one-shoulder wrap dress. Got it. Searching for fitting accessories! Look, guys. We need to put one arm through both openings. Like this. And we get this pretty draping. This dress will go perfectly with these shoes. Let's check. Okay. Yep, you're right again! And this summer look is just asking for these sunglasses. Wonderful! And what will the fourth dress look like? Let's make it a surprise! How can I pick accessories then? By guessing. Aww. Oh, Susie, there's a piece of fabric left in the basket! Oh, I'm gonna need it! Huh? So let's put the dress on one shoulder and wrap it around the waist. Then we'll tie the dress with the help of this small piece of fabric. There. We only need to smooth it out. Done! So I, uh, I'm at a loss. Let me choose this time. I'll take this. And this too. I'll try them on. And done! Wow, Susie! She looks even better than in the original outfit! Thank you for the gift, Sammy. It was fun! Today we made four dresses from one piece of fabric. But there can be an infinite amount of looks. Guys, which look did you like most of all? The mini dress with a waistband, the one-shoulder evening gown, the draped summer dress, or the longer dress with a cut? Write in the comments and try making new looks for your dolls! And if you liked my gift to Sue, I mean today's video, give a thumbs up! Bye-bye! It's a package from our grandmother! Seriously? What is it? What is it? Let me see! Hold on a sec. I haven't even opened it yet. Oh boy, oh boy, Sue! I'll burst with curiosity by then! Grandma always knew what candy Samantha and I liked the best. Not just you, you know. Oh, I see. I think I'm catching your drift. Help yourself, Sammy. Oh, a letter. You can read it. Dear Susie and Samantha, I'm sending you your Barbie dolls you left several summers ago, along with your favorite candies. I hope you are well. I hope to see you soon. Love you. Give my regards to Sam, your loving grandma. Hi, Graham. Sammy! Oh, there's something else. P.S. Samantha, try not to eat all the candies at once. It's bad for your teeth. Sam, you didn't eat all the candy, did you? Who? Me? No, of course not. I just tasted... Very, very yummy! Sammy! I'm sorry, Sue. These candies were so good that I just couldn't stop! Oh, Sammy, one
One day I'll have to do something about this. You can't eat so much candy. Yeah, I get it. By the way, your gram said something about the dolls. That's right. You want to see? I sure do. Oh, look at all these. It's a treasure trove. Yeah, kind of. Are you okay, Sue? You seem upset. Did you not like the package? I'm okay, Sammy. I liked it very much, but don't you think these clothes look a bit... old? Old. Yeah, you're right. Excuse me, Ish. I think this dress went out of style. I agree. Oh, Sammy, what should I do with them? Cheer up, Sue. We'll make new clothes for your dolls. They'll get the most fashionable wardrobe. Thanks for your support, Sammy. Let's get to work. Hey, everyone. Guys, let's see what kind of change we can offer to our beautiful models. First, we need the right fabric. Oh, which one to choose? Uh -huh. Susie! Oh, gosh, Sam, you scared me! I just wanted to say that last time you made really cool and stylish clothes from balloons. <laughs> you think so? Of course! Guys, you remember how Sue made balloon outfits for her own fashion show? Wasn't it amazing? Yeah, we can use balloons. Thanks for the tip, Sammy. Oh, is that your service, ma'am? For the first look, I'll need one large balloon, a small one, and scissors. I'll just cut off the tip of the balloon like this, and we'll get a top for the dress. Now I'll chop off the bottom, and voila! Our wonderful dress is almost ready. You always make it seem so easy. Thank you, Sammy. And now we'll add some style to this outfit. Guys, remember to be very careful with scissors. And don't be shy to ask an adult for help. Sue, I don't get it. Why did you cut out this triangle? It was already pretty. Oh, Sammy, you just don't understand. one shoulder tops are in fashion now. I don't see a difference. Sam, I hear you. <laughs> the rest of the balloon will make a great ruffle. If that's absolutely necessary. The details, Sammy. Fashion is in the details. That's what my professors say. I think I get it now, Susie! You're a great student, Sammy. Maybe you can tell me what's missing here? Yeah. How about a belt? Amazing idea. We'll make the belt from a different balloon. Right, guys? <laughs> Looks pretty to me. It really does. But you know what I see? This look lacks accessories. You're right, Sammy. I even have something for that. Now look closely. I'm cutting off a tiny piece of the balloon. And then I'll pull it through the ring and tie up. It might take a few tries because the balloon is too smooth and our future accessories are very small. My gross scuff thick. Yes, Sammy. Well, we just need to pick the right shoes and the outfit is ready. How about this pair? Wow, Sammy, it seems to me that these shoes go great with our new look. Happy to hear it. All right, it's time to dress this Barbie doll. I'll start the same exact way as I did the last time, just cutting across the balloon at an angle like this. And we have this unusual top. Let's try it on. Come on. Ugh. Cool. Next, we'll make a skirt of a darker color. Cutting it all. Susie, let's use this heart-shaped white balloon. Oh, no, Sam. We need this balloon for the next outfit. Look how the skirt turned out. Sue, <laughs> so where do you dress like this? I think it'll be great for both formal and casual occasions. Then tonight we'll have a super party! Hey, lady, would you like to dance with the best dancer in town? Oh, wait, Sammy. Cinderella almost forgot her shoes. Now we're talking. Isn't she beautiful? It came out great, Sue. Really? And now we'll try something new. Yay! I'll make an extremely fashionable top for this cute Barbie gal. Okay, guys. We need to make three more holes for the head and her arms. Just like this. Almost ready. The dolls have two hands, but I know the trick to make two sleeves in one cut. All done! Time to get dressed. Sue, how can I help? Hmm, maybe you could pick something for the next craft? 
This I can do. I had no doubt. Done. I always wanted to have a vintage blouse like this. What's this balloon for? A skirt. The highest quality material. This makes a great pairing with the top. Sam, maybe you could also pick the accessories? No problemo. I'm on it. Okay. Uh, no, no, definitely. Uh, no, 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 no. Um, there they are. Done. Sammy, what's that? I couldn't decide which pair would fit better, so I picked them both. Can you really wear it like this? You can do whatever you want if your stylist is slime, Sam. Uh, I like the way you think, but I'm afraid the model will be uncomfortable in different shoes. <sighs> As usual, great artists are unappreciated. Oh, don't say that, Sammy. So guys, we're down to our last Barbie. Let's make her dress less formal. Finally! Perhaps something casual for every day that is comfortable and pretty, too. Wait, what? What? I like it when it's comfortable. Not that I don't like those fancy dresses you made. Uh, we made, Sammy. Your help was very valuable. Just like the last time, I need to make the armholes. Actually, you're right, Sam. Formal gowns can be pretty uncomfortable. I don't even know how you girls wear all these heels and narrow dresses. <laughs> it's not that hard, and we don't have to do it very often. Just a skirt left. We're at the finish line! Yahoo! I think this skirt should have a front slit so she can move comfortably. Yes, yes, yes! Move, run, jump, dance, play ball! <laughs> right, Sammy. Let's try it on. Would you care to find more comfortable shoes for this look? With pleasure. And I'll make a belt for this cheery outfit. All done! I think these look good! Great, Sammy! They suit perfectly! Oh, I just love it! Wait, ladies! You forgot your accessories! You're so thoughtful, Sammy! Seems like we did a wonderful job. Now everybody looks stylish. Yes. Hey guys, do you like the new or the old outfits the best? Write in the comments. Good idea. We're curious what you think. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up to inspire our new design ideas. Bye for now. Bye bye.